everybody, I'm Alice Gall with 365 Barrington TV and today we're at the Remixed Barrington Library. Let's go check it out. Well, we called the event the Remix because we feel like um, even though we didn't expand the library, we've remixed it. We've moved everything around, we've tried to make it better, bigger, brighter, newer, um, and more innovative. So that's why we called it the Remix. This project was completely renovating two floors. And one of the big, biggest challenges for us was doing this in phases so that we could continue to serve uh, the uh, patrons of the library uh, as comfortably as possible. So what do you think you guys will be using this new space for the most? I think for me, since my kids are all grown, I do have grandchildren. And I'm going to bring two of them here probably this week. It's a, they've got a really nice section for the kids to play in and for the moms to get to know each other. So I'm here with Hunter. So Hunter, what is your favorite part of the new place you can get to play here at the library? The phone blocks. Why is it the phone blocks? Oh, you can build like anything you want to. What's your favorite part of this new space? My favorite part? Um, probably the light bright wall. I think it's really cool. Um, I used to have a light bright as a kid, so um, seeing it giant is really fun. <laughs> and one of the biggest things about the next generation of libraries is more than just being able to receive and get information from a library, being able to create information. So talk a little about, about what programs you have here to, to help us do that. Sure, and that's a great point because we are really transitioning to a, uh, a, a library that uh, provides an opportunity to, for our patrons to collaborate and create. And to that end, we've added several digital studios where you can do uh, audio and video production. You can do professional level uh, video editing. So tell us a little bit more about Studio One and how that's uh, contributing to the new Barrington Library. Studio One is a great place uh, to support community. Projects, uh, for all types of digital projects, whether it's uh, photography, music, or film. Uh, we have something for a lot of different roles and skills. Uh, we have a maker space that we're opening up for the first time uh, next week where you can do uh, uh, 3D printing. Uh, we have a laser cutter there so people will be able to do projects. What's cool about this new space that we have back here? I think what's really cool about it is that there are so many possibilities. So we fell in love with the vinyl cutter. It was the first machine we got. We can make stickers, we can cut things out of paper, we can make iron-on transfers. You know what I mean? You look at a machine and you think, oh, it's cool, it, it cuts. But it can cut so many different kinds of things. And now that we have the 3D printers, we just added a whole other layer onto it. So for example, we've printed things like um, bracelets, like little words, etc. But we're really, the only limits are people's imagination. It's about music and food and getting the community in the, our doors and just saying thank you for their patience and for their support. It's been great checking out the next generation of libraries here at the Barrington Library. Although it might look similar on the outside, it's a whole new world inside. For 365 Barrington TV, I'm Alex Gall, signing off.